My name is John Barker. This is the Skull and Mortar Kitchen, and today we are going to make a chicken. We're gonna smoke a whole chicken, and we're gonna use the Turbo Trusser to do it. Let's test this bad boy out. Let's see if it makes the presentation of the chicken go to that next level. Guys, they make two versions of the Turbo Trusser, one for chicken, one for turkey. All right, the instructions are on the back here. It looks very easy. You hook the legs, you hook the wings, you cook the freaking chicken, guys. Is it gonna be dark? Of course it is, because the lights are back here and I'm up here. But let's get into this, right? All right, guys, so the first thing we're gonna do is prep our chicken. We're gonna put it breast down. We're gonna hit it with that spray oil. And make sure you lift up the wings, get underneath the legs. And I know there's somebody out there again, we've had this debate over over and over again on this channel. I like this, it's the same oil that comes out of the bottle, guys. Don't be a dweeb, all right? So we've sprayed it. What are we gonna do now? We're gonna grab some of that God Save the Queen straight from skullandmortar.com. It's a thick boy grind for the thick boys out there. Uh, actually, it's for any size person. You don't have to be a thick boy. You could be a female if you want. Uh, I just really wanted to work the term thick boy in somewhere. So go ahead and give it a nice little dousing there. This is great because it's got salt, it's got pepper, it's got garlic, it's got some other little herbs and spices in it that are going to really maximize the flavors uh, of especially like poultry's beef. Uh, it's fire, you can use it on anything really, but it really shines on poultry and beef. Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna grab our skull and mortar OG rub. We're gonna give that a nice little dusting while somebody's car could clearly use some level of service on it, right? You guys hear that? Jeez, dude, it sounds like it's gonna explode over there, doesn't it? That looks good. Now this rub is good because it's gonna add some deeper pepper notes, right? It's gonna bring out the color of this bad boy. It's gonna look wonderful when it's done. So let's go ahead and flip it over. Oh, what do you guys think we're gonna do now? We're gonna use more spray oil, that's right. If you're gonna be pissed about it, get pissed now because we're going in underneath the wings, all around it. It's gonna help that rub stick. It's gonna help that skin get juicy AF. And again, some of that God save the queen. And again, with the skull and mortar OG rub. Get all over the wings, get a good covering everywhere. Go wild if you want, it doesn't really matter. As little or as much as you want. I like to give it a thicker coating because I like my chicken to have that deep rich color when it comes off the smoker. Now my friends, it's time to turbo trust this bad boy. All right, let's see if I'm smart enough to figure this out. Some little basic engineering here. So we're gonna take these hooks. I've already greased it up a little bit uh, with my fingers. So we're gonna take the hooks and the hooks just go through the eyes like this. So that's kind of clever. You got the little chicken image on here. Hooks go through the eyes. Okay, so now you just hook the legs right inside the turbo trusser just like that. That's pretty easy. Now we're gonna spin our board around here so we can get a better look at this. We're gonna take the hooks. The hooks go straight into, I don't know if it's better to go over, over or under. Let me take a look at the picture again. Okay, so it looks like on the picture they go outside the wings. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's see where we're gonna go here. Okay, easy enough. Let's hook this side over here. Now guys, you know what it's time to do. It's time to get this chicken on the smoker. I got my Char Griller 980 gravity feed up to 300 degrees. We're gonna slap that bad boy on there over some apple wood and we are going to see, does the Turbo Trusser make this fantastic, easy to make chicken even better? We're gonna check this back in about an hour and a half. I think it's gonna take about three hours to cook. 
All right, guys, it's been about an hour and a half and taking a look at our chicken, it is coming along nicely. It's still held together, so the shape is looking good. So in that regard, the turbo trusser is hitting the mark, but we're gonna give this about another hour and a half and I think that we'll be done about that time. The skin, still loose, it's still not crisp, uh, but that's normal for this stage in the game, right? This is a super simple cook. We're gonna close this lid, we're gonna leave it at 300 and we're gonna check back an hour and a half. Guys, I literally have chicken juice running everywhere. If you wanted to know, does the turbo trusser hold this all together in an appealing fashion? Yes, it does. This chicken looks fantastic. It's held its shape. Let's unhook these hooks and the trusser and let's just see, does it stay like that? Hell yeah, it does. Look at that. That looks way more appealing than a spread eagle chicken. Let's go ahead and bust this bad boy open and let's taste it because at the end of the day, the only thing that really matters, oh damn, it's so tender. Let's take a bite of this. Let's get a piece of chicken here. Whew, get some of that leg. Let's get some of that leg bite. Mmm. Wow. It tastes amazing. Guys, this is a basic chicken. You can literally not make it any simpler than this, I don't think. It's just, it's phenomenal. Look at that. Look how juicy and moist it is. The bone comes right out. Perfect. Now, we cooked the thigh to about 175, the breast to about 165. And the breast is just gonna take a little longer. Um, it just is what it is, but this chicken, come on guys. It tastes delicious. It looks amazing thanks to our turbo trusser. I'm a fan of this thing. I'm gonna link it down below. Feel free to grab one, man. I don't know how much it costs, but it's cool as hell. Um, they did a great job. So yeah, guys, thanks for watching. If you like this video, if you uh, learned anything today, if you just found a new way to cook an easy ass chicken for your family so you can have a nice dinner in you know about three hours or so um with you know very minimal work hit that like hit that subscribe i'm back all the time i do all kinds of easy cook videos for beginners uh, and you know every now and then i throw in a crazy cook so make sure you check out skullandmortar.com you can get my rubs my sauces you can get our t-shirts resurrect the dead shirts now down below the coolest barbecue gear in the game nobody has barbecue gear cooler than this so make sure you grab it all you have to do is leave a comment my dudes free shirt love you guys see you soon arrivederci i'm very cultured I should have ended this video a while ago, but I'm still talking. I talk too much. It's a personal issue that I have. I'm going to go ahead and eat some of this wing. Bye, guys. Hell yeah. That's good. See that juice dripping? Yum.